Youth Next with the UVA Center to promote effective youth development is working to find out how mental health and social media use are connected. CBS 19's Pim Dyer was at that event today. She joins us now with more from the studio. Hi, Pim. Hi, Dan and Cassidy. When you picture a teenager in 2024, the chances are you picture them with a phone. But we hear a lot about young people's uses of digital technology and experiencing increasing rates of depression, anxiety, and other mental health struggles. And Youth Next says these two trends are assumed to be joined at the hip. The Conference on Youth, Technology, and Mental Health brought together youth, practitioners, researchers, and policymakers. We all use different languages and different words so we can figure out how other people are talking about some of these issues, where we come together and where we might diverge, and then where we need to go to move forward. They are here to study how youth are using technology in their day-to-day -day lives and how policymakers are thinking about digital technology to support healthy youth development. It's really important that we listen to youth um, who are really at the center of this and that we center their voices as we think about how to think about the role of digital technology. In their research, they are finding that children are more self-aware than adults might think. Right? But they're also telling me that sometimes they spend more time on it than they wish that they did. And sometimes they find themselves scrolling and they think, I don't even know why I'm scrolling right now. And so they, they are really insightful into this kind of nuance here. They say that through this conference, they hope to have a deeper understanding and hear from young people about how they're feeling and what they're thinking about. In the studio, Pim Dyer, 